If you're new to cybersecurity, I want to share some advice from my five years of experience in learning, teaching, and working in this field. Now, let's cut right to the chase. Cybersecurity is challenging. It's a tough field to break into and build a career in. It requires a significant amount of effort, time, and mental energy. However, this challenge is what makes it worthwhile. I've had various experiences in a short time, and I want to share some tips and advice to keep you motivated despite the inevitable challenges of this field. Firstly, do not expect it to be easy. As a mid-level security engineer, I still struggle with many aspects of my day-to-day -day work, such as cybersecurity investigations, implementing security solutions, and responding to security incidents. I consider myself a calm person, but I often get frustrated when I can't figure out a query, a script, or fit the pieces of a puzzle together during a security investigation. Sometimes, the solution actually turns out to be the simplest one. And the worst part about this feeling is questioning your life decisions. You might start asking yourself if cybersecurity is really right for you. It can get crazy. Sometimes I've actually considered quitting my job and actually going to become a full-time musician. Obviously that has never happened, which is why I'm still in the field. But on the flip side, over time, I've actually learned to improve my troubleshooting and problem solving skills. And I can figure out solutions faster and more efficiently, but it took a lot of time and practice to get to that point. It is completely normal to feel frustrated. However, learning to overcome these feelings is one of the most impactful things you will gain. The ability to persevere and find a solution to a problem is one of the most satisfying feelings in the world. Just learn to not give up and keep going. Another amazing thing is this problem solving ability actually applies beyond just cybersecurity. You'll start to feel more confident in other areas of your life. You'll feel more capable of solving any problem that comes your way, which is always a great feeling to have. Now, all of that said, I made a whole video about this, how becoming a cybersecurity engineer is not easy. And also another video about how it all takes time to get into cybersecurity and become a cybersecurity engineer. Both will be linked in the description and somewhere on the screen right now, and even at the end of this video. And I encourage you to watch them, but after this video. Now, this leads me to my second point, which is the cybersecurity journey. The cybersecurity journey is continuous. Trust me, I know how it is now with social media like TikTok and you see someone talking about how they got into cybersecurity or how they can get you into cybersecurity in just 60 days or on LinkedIn where someone's like, I'm pleased to announce blah, 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 I got a cybersecurity job and all of that stuff. And I promise you, I used to be one of those LinkedIn people, but I'm no longer one of them. But back to the point, when you see these posts, you begin to ask yourself questions like, when is my time gonna come? I know this because I've been there before when I was still trying to get into the industry and it could be a demoralizing feeling seeing every one getting all these opportunities and you're still not getting any interviews or jobs at all. Look, some situations are anomalies. Everyone's background and experience is different and it's very toxic to compare your situation to anyone online. You have no idea where they're coming from. Even compare yourself to someone like myself who's been doing this since I was 18 and literally working in the cybersecurity industry since I was a teenager or anyone on any platform like Reddit, Twitter, and others where people share all these stories about being a teenager and pass it to OSCB and all these things about themselves is not a healthy thing to do and I want to discourage you from doing that. Now in reality there are actual motivational components to these stories which can light a fire under your butt and get you to work but the reality of things is that everyone learns and grows at a completely different pace. Over the years, I've guided several cybersecurity professionals on this channel and in our Cyberworks Academy Discord, which will be linked in the description. I encourage you to join. But all of these individuals had completely different journeys. They used different resources, and now they work in different domains of cybersecurity, and they all had different timeframes. Some it took them a couple of months, some a couple of years. Don't compare yourself to other people. Focus on your own progress because that's what really matters. Now, to wrap everything up, cybersecurity is one of the highest value skills you will ever learn. It offers you financial freedom and you have to work your way up to earn those six figure or multiple six figure salaries, but it's not impossible. There aren't many fields that offer this, but with cybersecurity, it is very possible. And it's one of the things that I appreciate about this skill set. It's very much worth it. But like I said, these are the two videos I recommended watching. They'll be on the screen right now, but I definitely recommend watching them so you can level set your expectations on how your cybersecurity journey should be. I'll see you over there.